Yeah. No, they knew we were babsing though. My mom was like, I know you sleep with her. Huh. <gasps> Auntie Sandy, please, I'm sorry. How could Chief Matt be stopped? What did Brian say that one time? How do you slow him down? How you, the same way you slow me down. You, you can't. I don't even know what the video is. This was shot before. Subscribe. <laughs> This is so crazy. I can't remember the last time oh. I had a boyfriend. Okay, guys. Yeah. Ready? So excited! Okay, let's do this. Well on, people. <laughs> I'm sure if you've clicked on this video, you've watched the video I dropped on Monday. Uh, and then you also know that this is my girl, Shay. Uh, yeah, so covering a few things before we get the podcast going properly. Seating arrangements. So Shay wanted to be on her good side. That's my good side. But um, I'm his girl now, she so made I a get deal. I want. Oh, really? Yeah. So you remember the deal we made? Which is what again? What did I say? I can't remember. I okay, so what I told Shay, I do remember. And oh. what I told Shay was, cool, I'll let you sit wherever you want, but I get sex. Excuse me? Whenever I want. Okay. I get a one time. Whatever you want. I mean, I mean, I get it whenever I want anyways. But remember, you said. I said, yeah, I said it's fine. Cool. cool. And now the reason I said you played yourself. Why? Is because I'm definitely going to wait till we're fighting and you're mad at me. And then you're going to pull the card. Mm-hmm. Makeup sex is the best sex, so I don't get it. Yeah, that's pretty true. <laughs> oh, yeah, then this is what I want to tell Shay before the pod. Well, I want to say before the pod. Uh, I was sitting here and I saw that you got your lip gloss on. Mm -hmm. And that's because I told Shay <laughs> from the huh. video on Monday Bro? that there was one bad comment about you. Yeah. And the comment was, yeah, I, I kind of fucks with Shay, but why are her lips dry 24-7? <laughs> and then I saw Shay made a special effort. <laughs> Drake Fest, 9th of Feb. I don't know if it's Waiting Room or another place it that says, started running uh, it. It Club Paradise, though. Oh, you saw it today? Yeah, I did see that. Okay, I got we're, the going, we're going, we're going. We're going, we're going, we're going. I don't know where Club Paradise is, though. I don't know. Somewhere in Cape Town. So it doesn't matter. Lewis, you know where Club Paradise is? Yeah, in town near the police station. Clean. <laughs> That's not. Why did I say that? Like, I'll be going to the police station yeah. after Club Paradise. Anyways. Might as but well. yeah, 9th of Feb. See you guys there. If you guys want to slide through, say what's up. Um, but yeah, Drake Fest, count me in. One concept I wanted to cover because there were a lot of comments about this on the video as well. Like, is this clickbait? You guys should know by now in the village, that's not the shit I subscribe to, bro. Like, that's not what I do. Yeah, I play around with some shit. Like, when Shay and I were fucking with each other, I would post, like, hinting at some stuff. But that's not clickbait, because if you clicked on the thing, no. anything that was in the title was in the video. Shay and I are together. And confirmed. to be fair, if you made it to the end of the video, you yeah. would have known. But you guys don't watch the video. That's the problem. That's true. Yeah, average view duration on YouTube videos is oh. horrendous. Oh, yeah. Shower thoughts. I had a shower thought today that I just wanted to talk about. I actually got really excited today because I was really, like, nervous. Not even like nervous stressed more like anxious because i had so much shit going on today i had to like get the review stuff sorted oh, i had to get our questions yeah. i had admin. to um yeah just a bunch of admin like that's what you know you guys don't see is like before we get to the shoot it's a bunch of shit i had to do but then when i was in the shower like just taking some breaths and i was like <sighs> you need to have fun with it because in life like you only experience life once you know, but then in my head, I was applying it to everything. It's like, I have one time to experience this podcast right here today. That's we can why. do more pods, but this podcast will never happen again. So why would I be stressed doing it? That's what I'm going to try to live my life according to now. I'm going to try to be less anxious about things and like overthinking things all the time. There was a comment on the video yesterday that said, okay, actually two. One of them is, and I quote, I'm subscribing again. I have to say, since y'all was teasing, I had unsubscribed. But now that my boy is becoming a man, I have again officially subscribed. Go Shay. She is blazing. What? I blocked homie. I blocked him. <laughs> off the YouTube channel. You can no longer view my videos. Who the fuck is that guy? I do not care if you've been unsubscribing and resubscribing. Like, people who make it seem that I'm in a legal contract with you guys to create content, that's crazy. This is a symbiotic relationship. You guys give me money by watching the videos and YouTube monetizes that ad revenue and gives it to me. And I provide you guys with entertainment. But I don't owe y'all anything you guys don't owe me anything but that's crazy bro bro is moving flamboyant when he typed that i just blocked him straight away but the comment that i want to talk about in relation to you oh he dm me and i don't really have beef with this guy so i just allowed it afterwards one sec bless you thank you are you really with the i really never saw you being with anyone until you were 60 but congrats and stop S advertising your girl nyash on the tube 60 that's a little while. Okay, but focus. Okay, sorry, my bad. Is congratulations. Stop advertising your girl's nyash on the tube. And I DM'd him, I'm going to show her off regardless. And this is how I feel. Because also, someone also commented on the YouTube video. Like, yeah, that's cool. But why would you post your girl without pants on on the YouTube video? It's like, bro, first of all, you were wearing panties that weren't like deep lingerie thongs or whatever. Yeah. It looked like a bikini bottom. Yeah. First yeah. of all. Second of all, this is my girl. <clears throat> and I'm proud of you. And I want to show everybody what I got. And I'm not disrespecting you by posting an image of you that other people would see if they saw you at the beach yeah. or they saw you on your IG page on or on IG TikTok page, or some true. shit like that. Do you feel disrespected by that? No, I thought it was fine. 
crazy it's crazy how other people want to form opinion and then they want to like make you feel like oh this is what they want to comment like they're reporting from you yeah like no. like you told them yo can you tell me that i don't really like my bikini <laughs> bro shut off also it's what you got yams <laughs> Yeah, I'm trying to nah I'm trying to show my girl off regardless I'm not gonna lie and I mean I've been working hard guys I've been putting in work Come at the on. gym why wouldn't I have the opportunity to show you guys what I got by the way everything we're speaking about now we've already spoken about this is for your benefit I feel like our relationship is a bit unique because it's not like the classic I saw Shay from across the room yeah and as I was like damn that, I want her that goes fine as yeah, fuck yeah, yeah. bro when we met Shay was not fine as fuck you were also not fine okay hold you on you literally okay, okay, look yeah, like yeah, no, no. who got Monyash in first year who got Monyash who got money? Okay, so fine, 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 fine. In first year, yeah. yes, fine. Or we can drop side by sides of first year us, and, we, and and the people can say who uh, is finer. Okay, okay, you know what? Let's not do that. Okay, <laughs> let's not expose each other right now. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> I don't usually like publicly let people know who I'm like seeing on the low because I just don't feel like it's their business. Yeah. So this is a first for me. Okay, let's just hop into the story. Let's hop into the story. <laughs> let's stop talking about like mindset, but let's let's stop overthinking this. <sighs> so story time. We'll skip over the early early mm. because I feel like the interesting shit comes like more recently. Mm. But Ooh. I liked Shay's friend. I was trying to slide on Shay's friend. Shay's friend was giving me bats initially. Yeah, then, which he loved. Yeah, yeah, that didn't deter me. I was like, <laughs> let me work harder. And then Shay was like, give him a chance, cool. Yeah. So then hooked up with Shay's friend. Just wanna <laughs> include that, I bagged that, cool. Come on, man, that's too easy. Shay and I just became friends like via the friend group. So yeah. we were friends for like, what, three, four years? I wanna say so. Up until that And it's like, we never really hanged out like one-on-one. -on -one. I don't know how that happened. No. From, from just being groups. in the group to like just us hanging out. I don't know. Well, I had a girl. So first year I got a girlfriend. Yeah. You I had did. a boyfriend and then shit ended. Oh, brother. I don't know if you, I, I don't know. When it comes to like Shay's personal shit, mm. that's not us. Like I'm going to let Shay decide decide how much you want to share. I'm not going to share your shit. Okay. So it wasn't really like a, like a, like a full blown relationship, but there was a lot happening that was a first in the relationship for me. So it was kind of deep okay. when things went down. Yeah. So you had a man's basically. Yeah. First year, then that ended. My relationship ended after yours, right? Like a year after yours. I think so. Maybe. Is it Something like that, because yours ended first year. Yeah, first Mine's, year, second semester. Mine ended second year in the middle. So anyways, I hopped out our relationship. Oh, do you know what's so crazy? My ex was wary of Shay, because Shay and I were good friends. But guys, I promise you, there was Nothing. no there was no sexual chem at all. And this is like, I think the, that was the first time we actually spoke in person. Like Not in person, it's like we actually spoke to each other. Like usually when what we're in mean? a group, right? We're always talking, but we've never had a conversation like mm -hmm. full on. Like I can't even remember what we spoke about, but that was the first time I remember having like a long conversation with you which was, which conversation when we were at jariah's place remember that's when the, like, i realized that she didn't like me like that. i don't remember that convo anyway so we were at jariah's place right it was okay. his birthday and i was on the bed because i wasn't feeling so well but everybody was in the room chilling cool 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 and then Wait, me no, and okay you spoke uh, we had like a conversation was i on the bed but everybody was in the room. Okay, cool. Yeah. yeah. Don't make this sound yeah, shady. Yeah. I'm not a yeah, cheater yeah, yeah, yeah. boy. Okay, like please. everybody was I'm in the room. Husband. Like she was also there. Well, and my then, ex. Yeah. Okay. We were all there. That's when I realized the stare that she gave me. Because oh, me and you were just talking. Okay. And like I think we were talking about something. Maybe she assumed that it was something deep that we spoke about. So when I looked over her side, I just got the dirtiest look and mm -hmm. I was like, Okay, I'm gonna back out. Cause like I don't want it to be a thing of like Damn, I'm like trying to take you a man. Yeah, That's yeah, not what yeah, yeah. was happening. Anyways, okay, let's go fast. But basically, just we did nothing no. shady while we were with our partners, whatever. No, we were both yeah. loyal to our partners. And there was nothing there. Ever. Like friendship level cool. But then basically, we both hop out of a relationship. We're both emotionally distraught. Like we both have issues from our past. So I feel like we found each other emotionally as friends still, by the way. Mm. So this was like For 2018, 19, yeah, 20, yeah, yeah. right? So 2018, 19, 20, we were just, we became like the best of friends. Like we hung out all Every the time. time. Like we were like each other's time, best friends. Yeah. Still platonically, nothing ever happened. Happened. Yeah. Most we lockdown, probably did was hug, but like it was like a two second hug, like a. Huh? Oh. Like yeah, a, no, 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 no. We had like nice hugs and shit, but it was all platonic. It was like the way yeah. I would hug like Abu or Tibbs or whatever. To be fair, like I don't know if I told you this, but I never like found Matt physically attractive. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, neither did I. Yeah. That's <laughs> don't say that like you have pity on me. Hold on. Yeah. Don't don't switch up the narrative. Cool. <laughs> anyway, so then end of lockdown, that was when like we had those bribes, right? At my crib. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so Abu Tibbs. Just Abu, the two. Huh? Just yeah. Them, Abu Tibbs and you. Yeah. Because cool. we like the four of us used to <laughs> hang out all the time, so it wasn't like a we it was weird. Mm -mm. Yeah, you can tell the story. So this is a, this is the first time we lipsed was end of 2020. But so what happened was we were at Matt's place having the braai, whatever, drinking. And because I'm a heavyweight, I basically I drank all of them and I had to put Tibbs and Abo to bed. And then I went to go put Matt in, like, in his bed, make sure that everybody was fine. <laughs> I go to my room, get into the bed. Next moment, Matt comes into the room and I'm like, oh, cool. He's just, he's just awake. 
So I'm like, oh, we're just gonna chop. <laughs> yeah, boy. So now we're sitting on uh, the oh, bed. Oh, and we we had like slept in each other's beds like times yeah, before. Yeah, like, like when I used to stay at your crib drinking, but yeah, like all platonically, but like, like nothing to the ever other happened. Side, like you yeah, always yeah. slept on one side, like. And then somehow in his brain, he just thought that today was a good idea just to like test the waters, right? So he's in the room, cool. We chatting, 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 and then I'm like, okay, cool. It's late. I'm gonna go sleep. Next moment, Matt moves closer to me, and I'm like. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna let this slide because like, I'm like, maybe he just, he just wants to be closer to another person. Cool. And then I don't know how it happened because also I'm also late at this point. You looked at me and you're like, can I kiss you? <laughs> and my first thoughts were, there's only two ways that this can go. Either it's gonna be very trash, mm -hmm. right? Or it's gonna be okay. But then tomorrow morning when we wake up, I'm not gonna bring it up. I'm just gonna be like, we had a kiss last night, but like, let's not talk about it. Like, we don't ever have to talk about it. And I don't think I've ever told you this, but when I said yes and we, we kissed, it was different, like from any other hookups that I've ever had. Mm. Yeah, but he doesn't remember it because he was drunk. Yeah, I was drunk. And I have a great memory and I'm. <laughs> no, I don't know what happened to you that night that you remember this as well because yeah. most recently when you've got drunk like you forget everything if I take a it's like because I took a break from drinking alcohol uh, and then came back and now just like I can't do it anymore okay so that was end of 2020 mm. right that was our first kiss and then we just so we were weird like we were weird afterwards like we were just like I don't think it was weird no we were weird like, in terms of like now that we've kissed yeah. now we've always did that line like how do we go about like just no, being no. normal friends now you're not remembering correctly you were weird about it yeah, I, I was, was chilled I was, I was breezy because when I woke up then did we lips in the morning again yeah I think, I think we, we wanted did. to just make sure so, so then oh by the way the kissing is fire yeah especially in the beginning like your first year two years like physically was just yeah. wild yeah but i mean good. you know we still good at what we do yeah that's <laughs> it, but we're getting better you yeah, know yeah. we get better every time then after that it was moving to like okay when we finna babs because like for the for two uh, months that's yeah. when you were being weird because shay was so nervous about it because like we had lips and then she was cool with it but like about Babs scene, like she was so scared that it was gonna be trash because she was like, How is this gonna affect the relationship? And I was like, Listen, let's try. Yeah. If it's whack, it's whack, and it's cool. So then one night she got drunk in town. <laughs> then she sliced to my crib after. Um, yo, are my Renz watching this video? <laughs> By the way, when I dropped the video yesterday, I had to tell my Renz. Um, really? Did you tell them? Yeah, I told them, yeah. You, by the way, they were so surprised. I was shocked. No, that's weird. There's they were no surprised. Way. No, they knew we were Babsing though. My mom was like, I know you sleep with her. Huh. <gasps> Auntie Sandy, please, I'm sorry. <laughs> like, were they just surprised that we're together now? Yeah, they were surprised that we're together, but they've been knowing. Well, you're loud, so obviously they're gonna know at some point. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Shay slides to my crib. She goes out on a night out, gets lit, slides to my crib. I'm home alone, comes in the crib, and she's like, Matt, I'm so nervous. I was, I was like, Oi, Alexa, take off your clothes, bruh. So now Shay gets naked, bruh. She's lying butt ass naked on my bed. And uh, yeah, we hit it. And it was cool yeah. the first time. It was yeah, cool. Yeah, it was like, good. It wasn't right. crazy. It was yeah. cool. And then after that, oh, it just, yeah, based on my life. Yeah, it's I, physically we're very compatible. But I feel like that's built up from the emotional connection we we have from being best friends. Maybe, I don't no, know. It's, uh, for, okay, for me, I'm I'm sure. Okay. Like I just okay. know that it's because we've been through so much together and we know each other so well that like when we have to apply ourselves physically, it's, we it's don't even easier. have to think about it. We just mesh. We click together like a puzzle piece physically. Yeah. Tip for the girls: if you're ever with a gent and trying to see if you guys are compatible, just cuddle. Because sometimes you can tell from the cuddling whether or not the point. baps is gonna be good. Yeah. Because if you guys get into a cuddle position and it's awkward, like you guys have to yeah. figure things out, it just means that you physically just won't be compatible. So then the sex part would also be very awkward. You guys won't really find each other like that. Mm. But when you cuddle and it just does this i'm so not surprised that like because i'm saying our compatibilities are but i'm just it's so weird how we went from like platonic like to straight platonic to, like, to yeah very attracted to each other. anyways okay cool so then after that that was end of 2020 okay. we both Ooh. agreed friends with benefits yeah we did we and agreed. i could do it of course i could do it <laughs> but then i i couldn't do it anymore because i realized that like <laughs> I wanted him to all to myself. Like, I didn't like experiencing Matt the way I did. And then another girl being experiencing him the same way. I was like, nah, that's not going to happen. Yeah. So basically, Shay caught feelings. I never caught feelings. I mean, I was living life. I was enjoying. Because <laughs> I had best of both worlds. That's why I kept on telling Shay. I was like, I'm enjoying life. Yeah, you know, why like, would I got I, you. Why would I got This yeah. is fire. And then every time I feel like snacks, I can just dabble. From end of 2020, 2021... The whole of 2022, we were like on and off. Yeah. We were never together during that yeah. time. We were just on and off. Being friends with benefits because we would go, 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 then you get emotional. Yeah. Then we'd go, 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 and you get emotional. But, um, oh, just me. Huh? Just me. Emotional, just me. <laughs> okay. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, we had, okay, we had sessions. We had ups and downs. I feel like we were different to some story time. But basically, I just feel like we would always end up back together. But my thing was always like physically being with someone I else. I was better. And you're, no. 
physically I was I mean, better. yes, but no, that's not what I'm saying. I feel like <laughs> no my team was me. always like uh, physically, like just having what I want. Yeah. But then your team, like you were trying to find connection elsewhere because you weren't mm. getting that from me. Mm. But then that would vex me. So then Shay would be possessive over me physically, I guess, and I'd be possessive in like, every other way. Yeah. We were so cringy, like at some point. We were operating like a, like a <laughs> high school Netflix movie, man. Like we'd like Shay would be like fucking with somebody and then I'd be like angry texting yeah. her and like I can't sleep at like 3 a.m. Then I'm here hopping in the whip and driving yeah, to the crib. Driving to I'm my at crib. At her door, we're making out passionately. But that's one of my good memories about us is that, that moment. Like yeah, I think yeah, we yeah. weren't speaking for like two months. Yeah. And then... Uh, I mean, it's cringy, but sometimes when you're living it, it's it's very nice. And yeah. It's very cute and whatever. Anyways, so then towards the end of last year, Shay hits me with the ultimatum. She's like, listen... I can't keep doing this. Yeah, it's no beef. Yeah. But like, and she, you know, Shay's taking care of herself, which, which I understand. And you got to respect that. But she gave me the option. She wasn't like, do this now. She was like, yo, you got to pick yeah. this, this or that. And I picked this. Um... And yeah, now we're here. In terms of like where we're going, I've told you like I don't see a future like mm. right now. I don't know if I see a future with anyone. Yeah. I've just always been living my life expecting to be single after my last relationship. Like I was like, I don't want any of that. In the same vein, I just think that I am very harsh on myself emotionally. Like I always paint myself as a villain internally when I'm like, oh, I got to make these decisions. Like, oh, I'm going to hurt Shay. Like, but I also have emotions and I'm... I'm trying to realize that sometimes like i just got to live my life you know like we're here we made this option mm -hmm. we're gonna move forward and we're gonna see what happens if it don't work it don't work yeah. but this is what i chose and i'm gonna stick to my decision you feel me but yeah <laughs> anyways last thing last 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 thing we're out how much do we want to show you guys so i just want to talk about that quick mm. like i said i'm respecting shay's space on her personal thing i did tell shay obviously before we hopped into this i'm keeping a buck with you guys i'm very open you guys yeah. know everything about me so when it comes to us it's kind of middle ground but mm. i told Shay like before we hopped into this you guys are finna know a bunch mm. but at the same time it's also nice to just protect our space a little bit yeah we will be obviously out there people will know we together but i don't have to be posting matt all the time on my stories when couples do that it's like people wait for your downfall so now all of a sudden when I don't post Matt mm. now they're like are you guys still together da, da, da. then I'm like no I was talking time. more about like emotional access oh like if we have a fight or whatever I'm gonna talk about it like on a video we'll talk about this okay like the fact that we have to have an we'll, open we'll discussion talk. we'll know yeah. we'll have a discussion about it and a then discussion. determine because you can't be Where like we're gonna have the discussion <laughs> stop <laughs> last last thing this is not a thing of oh I'm a relationship boy now mm. I know everything we don't know what we're doing we're hoping no in this idea. decision we make, we're just two humans doing life for the first time like the rest of you. So, um, yeah, just be understanding. Don't be an NPC when you comment. My content's not going to be affected. It's me that's making the content. Same guy at the end of the day. Yeah. So it's going to bang regardless. Appreciate y'all. Catch you when I catch you. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God.